for over a billion years, Earth had been sleeping, silent, blue, breathing clouds and tides, but beneath the waves, something had begun. This was the Proterozoic Eon, the long dawn before life would roar into the light. In the deep, sunless oceans, simple life stirred, microscopic, fragile, but unstoppable. Cyanobacteria, tiny architects, released oxygen with every breath. Slowly, invisibly, they rewrote the chemistry of the world. Oceans rusted, skies cleared, and Earth's great transformation began. Multicellular life emerged, strange, soft-bodied beings drifting in alien seas. The Ediacaran creatures, no eyes, no bones, just shapes like living shadows. But evolution was not done. It was only gathering strength. Then something changed. 540 million years ago, a spark. In a geological heartbeat, life exploded into complexity. This was the Cambrian, a planetary awakening. Eyes evolved, mouths, teeth, claws, shells, for the first time, creatures could see, could hunt, could flee. Trilobites scuttled across the seafloor. Worms with armor and spikes wriggled through the sediment. Giant predators with grasping claws sliced through the water with alien grace. Every niche, every shape, every strategy tried, tested, born. Life was no longer passive. It was in motion, in conflict, in bloom. From a silent world of microbes, the Earth had become a living canvas. The biosphere surged forward, bold, wild, endless in its imagination. And though none of these first creatures would see beyond the waves, they set the course for everything to come. The journey from cell to sight, from stillness to motion, from single spark to symphony. This is life's great awakening. And the story has only just begun.